our climate is changing and getting hotter. This can lead to heat illness when the body overheats because of hot weather. Children and pregnant people are especially vulnerable. Their bodies are less able to regulate heat. Children also aren't good at monitoring their own symptoms, so they need their caregivers to protect them. People who live in communities with more pollution, less green spaces, and less resources to stay cool have added health risks that are worsened by climate change. Symptoms of heat illness include dehydration, muscle cramps, headaches, dizziness, or irritability. More severe symptoms can include vomiting or seizures. Exposure during pregnancy may cause premature birth. Pay special attention to heat if kids wear heavily padded sports gear such as shoulder pads or helmets, live or go to school in an area with little shade or with lots of roads and parking lots, cannot easily communicate when they feel hot, or are strapped into a car seat or stroller. Never leave children unattended in cars. During extreme temperatures, limit outdoor activities. If they're necessary, wear a sunscreen and a hat. Stay hydrated in cool indoor spaces. To reduce heat-related effects of climate change, get involved in your local community and schools and support improved green space and access to cool indoor spaces with filtered air. Check out the Western States PACU for more information on children's environmental health.